Hello and welcome to PT exam prep study topics. Today I'm going to be going over what happens after a dislocation of the radial head. First, let's talk about which ligament is torn. Now in the image here you can see two white boxes. Can you take a guess at which ligament we're hiding? If you said the annular ligament, you're right. The reason I want to bring this to your attention is because it's a really important pathology that mixes in your knowledge of musculoskeletal pathologies and pediatrics. Let's talk about this. So we know that younger children, particularly girls, are vulnerable to this subluxation of the head of the radius. We normally see the history in these cases, or you may see it in the vignette, as saying that the child was suddenly lifted or potentially they were holding on to a leash and a dog quickly jutted away. We'll see that the upper limb, when the, we'll see this in the upper limb when the forearm is pronated. The child will usually cry out and refuse for you to touch the limb. They'll often protect it by holding it with the elbow flexed and the forearm pronated. The sudden pull of the upper limb tears that distal attachment of the annular ligament. The pain that people are getting is because there is that pinch of the annular ligament. Thanks for joining us. Are you looking for help to prepare for your upcoming exam? Head over to ptprep.ca where you can learn all about our courses. If you still have questions, shoot us an email at info at Thanks for joining me today.